Hello everyone and welcome or welcome back to my channel. I'm Teacher Casey and thank you for being here. It has come to my attention from a couple of my most popular videos that some things have changed in Zoom and things may look a little bit different. So I'm gonna take you through that whole process again and show you what's new and how you can fix it or how you can start streaming in Zoom to either YouTube or Facebook. So for today, we're gonna to focus on connecting Zoom and YouTube. All right, let's get started. Okay guys, first things first, we are going here to Zoom. Now, once you set this part up, you will not have to continue to set it up because it'll be done for you. But the first thing we do is we go into settings. I always go to email notifications and scroll up just a little bit to this. You will see allow live streaming of meetings. When I first got started with Zoom or doing this, there was like three, maybe four. I don't think Twitch was on there. Oh yeah, Twitch and Workplace for, by Facebook was not on here but they are now so i just click them all so that they're all ready so check those boxes and you won't have to check them again you're gonna have to look and see if you're going to need to submit or save or anything like that so that's it for this part super easy right so that is one of the most important parts without all of those set up or checked it's not going to work so now let's go into schedule i'm going to schedule a meeting tomorrow i have a live youtube video coming so we're just going to do meet piano teacher cheryl now this part is only for you so you can write meet piano teacher cheryl you can write learn piano lessons whatever you want to write it's up to you like I said, my video is going to be at tomorrow at 9 a.m. Eastern. So that's 8 a.m. my time. And that's all I need to do so far. I'm going to save. Now, something that is different is this here, live streaming. We used to scroll all the way to the bottom and you would see what you needed down below, but now it is here. It took me a minute to find it yesterday. You can see all those boxes we checked show that my meetings support live stream to the following services all right we're going to configure this here in just a minute but we need to get some information from youtube first all right here is youtube i am going to go to my channel and i am going to start getting ready for a new live so create go live some of that has changed as well so i hope you're watching I'm going to schedule a stream. If you don't see this screen, sometimes you might have webcam on here or stream. I'm going to manage because I'm scheduling it. All right, I'm gonna create a new one. That was the one I did yesterday. And for now, I'm just gonna make up a title, but I already have this done in TubeBuddy. So, piano lessons with Cheryl. Okay, I'm gonna skip the description because like I said, I already have it to, on my YouTube buddy my two buddy <laughs> all right streaming software that is new here categories i am education thumbnail i can upload a thumbnail here but i already have that done in two buddy as well select this is what playlist i want i'm going to do a meet the teacher one i do want to tell you for the thumbnail all i did was go to canva hopefully you can see it here i made something in canva and then i downloaded it i specifically made a youtube thumbnail that's it, super easy. Then no, it's not made for kids. If you do not select something here, you will not be able to continue most times. Monetization, I am monetized, so I am going to turn it on for this video. Next, next. Public, everybody watch it, <laughs> hopefully. Okay, now it's going to take just a second and I'm going to show you what to copy and paste into Zoom, okay? Here we go. Here we go, right here, easy. Stream key, copy, go to Zoom. I'm going to configure. Stream key is right here. Copy, paste. Stream URL, copy, go up here, stream URL. Okay, friends, the tricky part. You need to go and find your video that you just did. So I, I know there's other ways to get here. I just go to manage videos. I go to my lives and then it's always the first one there, upcoming. Click on details and to get that link, I click here. But first I want to add my TubeBuddy that I made. So I'm going to load from saved drafts, piano lessons for kids and adults. Next, 
next. <laughs> Click all the way through and then I'm going to apply it to the video. And save my changes. And then back where I said you're going to copy, we're just going to copy this link. And this is the last link that needs to go here. Now, I don't do anything with these two boxes. I would love to know if you do, let me know what you use that for, but I always just click save here. Voila, it is saved. Now, the next thing I do, I go back into details. This is new again, and that is where you can copy your invitation. So it's a little bit different. I'm gonna copy this invitation and then send it to my friend. All right, I am back. So. Let's see, we went over checking those boxes. It's very, very important. Then we scheduled our meeting. We set up our live in YouTube and then we took those three links and put them over to Zoom and that should be it. Let me know if you've tried this, if you have any trouble. I've been able to walk people through it either live or through chatting on my YouTube videos. So if you need anything from me, don't be afraid to put it in the comment section below or email me casey.oswald at gmail.com. Usually pretty good about getting back to people. And that's about it. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please don't forget to subscribe, like, chat, share, all the things that brings us together as a community. And I will see you all next time. Thank you everyone. Bye.